never seen so much blood, man. I'm still shaking, man. I can't get the fucking image out of my head. Dude, I swear I almost fucking vanished. I almost threw up. I mean, damn, man. I mean, you know, I knew the bitch was crazy, but I didn't know she was like crazy, crazy, you know? Come on, man. Give us some respect. No, nah, you know what I mean, right? I just can't imagine. Imagine what? Getting to that point. I mean, we all feel like giving up sometimes, right? But that's when we fight. We all get sad. It ain't about being sad. It's a disease. The girl had a disease, man. Anyway, I got something I got to tell you guys. Nope. Mm -mm. We can't take no more drama. Mom bought a new house. Um, it's a few hours outside of town. And she asked me to go with her. And you said no. Right? Tell me you said no, T. Bro, you can't just leave, man. We still have prom, graduation. T, man, you can't just run away from everything. Actually, I can. I need a fresh start, man. And living in this city, I feel like I'm drowning sometimes. I really do. But, I miss you guys. I really will. If our group chats don't stay lit, I'm coming out there and beating that ass, T. <laughs> Have you talked to T at all? Yeah, actually I did today. How is he? Good. Um, I mean, I guess he says he's leaving the city. So he's not coming back to school. What? Like forever? I mean, could you blame him? He's been through hell. Do you want to just, um, hang out tonight? Watch The Office? Just want to hang out in bed? No, you're killing me. Because I really want to, but I can't. I gotta go work on that thesis with Vesper. Oh yeah, I forgot. But I can totally cancel. No, that's fine. You sure? Mm-hmm. Are you mad? Nope. 
and it feels like you're mad. Well, I'm not. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna go piss. Did you try to get in my phone? No. <clears throat> well, it's on. Well, did someone text you? No. I don't know. clinic and they're gonna let me come in at six today but they are recommending that I bring someone and I um I haven't really told anyone else so I was hoping that you would come with me yeah of course I'll be there okay have you talked to Gabe yet um no I've just made my decision you know Oh, I wanted to ask you, sorry, um, how are you feeling? I'm good, why do you ask? Well, Gabe just told me about T, so I wanted to check in with you. What about T? I don't know, uh, Gabe told me that he was leaving town. It sounded like he wasn't coming back, did he not tell you? Last box, Mama. T, seriously? Are you fucking kidding me? Olive, we don't have to do this. Yes, we do. You're gonna call me out on my shit, then pull something like this? What are we gonna do? Go ghost on me? And expect me what? Just to move on and make up some little story in my head to make myself feel better? What?
What are you doing here? Adele and I broke up. <laughs> what are you looking up? I was just wondering what I should do with these. You should. Do whatever you want. Tell me. I want you to... put them inside me. How many? Hey, why aren't you answering my texts? Are you still coming? Yeah, I'm literally on my way. Oh, and um, Sarah's coming. Hey, Bree. Hey, Sarah. Okay, well, will you guys just get your asses over here? <laughs> okay. Bye. Olive, what's going on? We're getting an abortion. We? Are you okay? Yeah, yep. Yeah. I'm just, you know, I'm so excited about diving into this French cinema. Well, if we're gonna watch a movie, we should do it soon. Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean, what do I mean? Um... Just, yeah, we, we should watch the movie soon because yeah. that's why I came over here. Yeah. What else would we do? <laughs> you know, I've actually never had a boy over. Never? Never. <laughs> well, okay. Um, geez, I don't know if I should be, like, terrified or kind of <laughs> thrilled. Well, if my dad was home, you would definitely be terrified. Oh, jeez, the scary father trope? Mm -hmm. How original. Mm-hmm, you better be careful. Jeez, okay. Very scary. <laughs> Are your parents, like, uh, like, really religious and stuff? Yeah, Muslim big time. Ooh. What about yours? Uh, you know, I kind of, sometimes I wish they were. My dad's an atheist, my mom is a Buddhist. Oh, Buddhist, fancy. Fancy, yeah, yeah, they're real, they're real fancy. What can I say, I come from an unconventional home. Mm-hmm, I can tell you're pretty postmodern. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, I'm postmodern, okay. So, um, we should probably watch the movie. Yeah. Let's watch the movie.
Hey. It's me. Hey. Hey. I'm glad you came over. I really wanted to talk to you about something. Yeah, can I just... Can I go first? Yeah, sure. What's up? I fucked up today. Are you okay? I, um, I kissed Vesper. Actually, that's a lie. Um, we had sex. What? Bri, I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. I, I, I kind of got overwhelmed and I, I, I... I'm sorry, I just need you to stop talking for a second. Um... I got an abortion today. That's why I wanted you to come over. What? When? Today. I had it today. Uh... Are you okay? No. I mean, yeah, I'm fine. You know what, actually, I'm, I'm fine. I think I just really need you to leave. No, that's not really fair. What do you mean? You want to talk about what's fucking fair? That's... that's funny. Bree! That's not fucking fair! Bree, come on. Bree! <laughs> hey, how'd it go? Thanks again for today, guys. Mm -hmm. Didn't you used to have like a poster on the ceiling? Mm -hmm. What does that have? Channing Tatum. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, she did. Before she realized that she's a flaming homosexual. Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, simmer down, you two. <laughs> Won't be here all night. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs>